difference a day can make because this is what it looked like yesterday. Dash cam video showing the uh, truck stop on I-35 and uh, right on the side of the road, the uh, semis lined up there before the uh, I-35. Everybody wanted to go north. Uh, it was finally opened back up, but you can see the place was packed with semis just waiting out on the closure. Uh, that is where we find local fives Lake and McGee. She made some friends yesterday up north as people were waiting to get back on the roads. Lake and good morning to you. How are things looking? Good morning, Elias. Yeah, so luckily the interstate is back open and that means not a whole bunch of people are actually out there at the rest areas. But the one we are at here in Huxley, we do have David Ogden here joining us. Uh, you're just in, you work maintenance here. So uh, kind of just explain what you saw yesterday. A uh, lot of cars in the ditches, a lot of slippery roads, a lot of drifts in the in the middle of the road. So a lot of problems. So as you were coming into work yesterday, I mean, the interstate was kind of back open. Uh, tell us what I mean, just what was happening out here? Um, there was a lot of trucks, a lot of traffic. We had, I know, a restaurant come in and help feed some of the truck drivers that was stranded here. Um, just people trying to help out and trying to stay safe. And have you seen anything like this before? No, I've been here since the rest area is open and I've never seen anything like this. All righty. Well, thank you so much. Hopefully we don't have to deal with this again. No problem. Yeah. All right. Thank Drive you. Uh, you guys heard him. Drive safe out there. Also want to remind you that the tow ban has been lifted. So all those vehicles that are in ditches, you're going to hopefully see them get cleared up. Uh, also want to remind you that the Iowa DOT did tweet out that conditions have improved here in Story County as of last night at 10 p.m. Reporting live in Ames, Lake and McGee, Local 5 News, we are Iowa. Yeah, Lake and those uh, drivers are on the clock now to get those uh, cars out of the ditches. Thank you so much.